Hello and welcome again to this edition of Fight TV. I'm your host, Brad Swanson. We are coming to you from inside the Florida Capitol during the 2022 Florida Legislative Session. We are joined by none other than our friend, Christine Hunchowski, Representative. Welcome back to the program. Thanks for having me, Brad. Well, look, we know the topic of Parkland is always a heady topic. It was a tragedy and your district was ground zero for it. What's the latest on, on what's been happening with school safety and things like that? Yeah, thanks for asking about that. I was mayor at the time of the shooting at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas, so our community was incredibly impacted by all of that. My focus up here has been a lot on school safety and mental health. We have a school safety package that's right now moving through the process. Additionally, I have a, a bill on mental health for students where if a student is getting behavioral health services at the school, the school is also required to let the families know what services are available to them at the school and what services are available in the community. So important, you know, we, we look at, you know, that, that, that catastrophe, but you look at so many of the telltale signs and it's that, that very counseling and that very mental health that, you know, we, we seek to avert tragedies like this in the future. Yeah, it's a whole layered system for security. It's, you know, making sure you know who's on your campus, um, making sure that people are getting the services they need, uh, making sure that we have different layers of security. For example, we had the Coconut Creek Police Chief, who you know very well, Butch was here this past week being honored on the floor, and they're working with actually a dog who can sniff ammunition as an additional layer of security in the schools. Yeah, you know, I mean, having known uh, Chief Arnell, um, he's one of those forward-leaning, um, you know, forward-thinking law enforcement uh, professionals. And the idea of having a gunpowder-sniffing dog, I mean, most people think about drugs and narcotics or whatever. But, but, you know, we've come to that day and age where it's legitimately needed. Yeah. It's just important that we look at the whole range of safety issues that we can do, not only at schools, but also throughout our communities. Well, well things are gearing up here. We're, we, we're, we're done with uh, a lot of the budget conversations, not all of them. How you how you hanging in there? We've got a couple of weeks to go. Listen, we have 60 days in this process. It is a marathon. I'm just honored to be able to be here to serve my district and the re residents of the state of Florida. And I'm ready to go and continue through through all 60 days. Well, Representative, thank you so much for coming on. Good luck to you in these last two and a half weeks. We know there's a lot more to be done, but uh, we're just grateful that you share your time with us and your perspectives. Thank you. Thanks for the opportunity, Brad. I appreciate it. That's all the time we have for this episode of Fi TV. Make sure you hit us up for more great interviews like this one on our social media feeds. And for now, thanks for tuning in.